Hello all you coin aficionados out there and welcome to DC Coin World International Coin Channel. And today we have the one pound coin and the one pound note from the Republic of Ireland. And of course we look over here on the left and we see the one pound or one punt coin. Down here uh, we can see that it has the one pound and uh, it has the famous uh, red deer on it. It's the Thomas Ryan engraving and uh, just a kind of a beautiful um, animal engraving with the uh, beaded inner rim. If we tip it up, we see that it has a specialized security edge with these beads inside. So it's like a sandwich kind of edge with these beads inside. Um, and it, it's not, there's no writing on this one. It's just these dots that go on the inside. And if we flip it over, we see that it says Ireland 1990. And then over here, we see Queen Maeve. Or um, I've heard some of the um, Celtic scholars pronounce it Queen Medv. Medv. And uh, it's also, um, it's spelled M-A-E-V-E, -E, but it's also spelled M-E-D-B. Like, see that right up here, the M-E-D-B. That's another way to spell uh, her name. And then you can also see it down here at the bottom of the note, uh, sometimes spelled like this in, uh, I believe, in Gaelic. Now, if we look at this note, um, we see that it is from um, the year... 1989 and we'll take the coin off and we'll come back to that later so it's uh, 12 4 89 so ireland uh embraced a decimalization uh pretty much in 1971 when great britain and a number of other countries did and they uh continued to make um the one pound um coins but they made all of the coins a percentage of the one pound so you would see uh, a 5p from after um, 1971 would be 1 20th of a pound. Uh, of course, a 2p would be uh, 1 50th of a pound. Now, when uh, Britain um, started making the pound coins in 1983, the Republic of Ireland did not. They kept making these paper banknotes. Uh, and in fact, they did not uh, change over until 1990. So this is the first of the one pound coins from Ireland. And then this is the last of the one pound banknotes from Ireland. They kept making the five pound banknotes after this, but this is the last one pound banknote of uh, the 1989 edition. It's also in, the, if you look it up in the book, it's the um, 70... Uh, D edition, and these are the signatures um, of uh, M.F. Doyle and uh, Mr. Chromian. Here uh, it says Bank of Ireland, uh, one pound. Um, uh, actually, it says Central Bank of Ireland, one pound, and on the back it actually is here in English. I believe this is a uh, engraving from the Book of Kells. Uh, that's on the back. So when you look at this, you go, why? That's really busy, and why did they do that? So this is the famous uh, Book of Kells, and this is, a, I believe, a page from it. Now, if there's a couple things I can show you about this note that are kind of worth looking at, and one is, of course, the watermark. And what I'll do is I'll turn the light on, and I'll turn uh, my light table, light off, and my light table on. And you can see Queen Maeve uh, right here looking to the left and if we flip it over she's also on the watermark here uh, looking to the right uh, you also see that there's a security strip here a metallic strip uh, used to prevent counterfeiting so this is a, a very nice looking note um, but um, it went the way of uh, all paper uh, dollar uh, and pound coins um, because it, it, it was so much uh, cheaper in the end to make these one pound coins because they would last forever and in fact if you look at this one you see that um, it, it has lasted incredibly. Now how much is the one pound uh, note worth? The one pound note is probably worth 
This one has a little bit of a bend on the edge here, so it may not be very fine. So it's probably worth six to eight dollars, depending on um, uh, whether you have access to them or not. Um, and the one pound coin that we have here um, from 1990, uh, that's also, of course, been replaced in 2002. This was demonetized and the euro came out. So this one here is probably worth in this shape um, a couple dollars, maybe dollar fifty to two fifty, depending on uh, how it is kind of um, valued in terms of is it a very fine? It's probably not an extra fine, so probably in the one fifty to two dollar U.S. range. All right, so that's all we have today from uh, the country of Ireland or the Republic of Ireland or the former Irish Free State, and I should also add that. The uh, Northern Ireland, they use the um, British pound sterling, but we do have a Northern Ireland one pound sterling note that we're going to have in another video. And uh, that's kind of interesting also because uh, just the way that they um, used the British coinage in Northern Ireland, but they used uh, the Northern Irish um paper money. But that'll be in another video. So look forward to that, and we'd love to have you watch it from the DC Coin World International Coin Channel.